Oh, thank you too. So hello from Pokhara, Nepal. Today we're going to be meeting a guy called Krishna and he's going to be taking us up into the mountains in order to see what the people live like in the villages. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you too. You're welcome. You are welcome. Maybe see you after coming? Yeah, yeah. maybe yeah. see you after. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye. So Krishna and his wife actually have a local laundry service here in Pokhara and that's where we met him. Once we were waiting for our laundry, we actually started talking to him and then he invited us to come and stay by his house in the mountains. Hi Krishna. Yes, I'm next to the statue here by Tulip Dental. Okay, blue collar and jacket. Okay, he's coming. Okay. <laughs> so this is kind of what the Jeep station looks like here in Pokhara. It's not really a station, more just on the side of the road. But I know we need to be taking one of the buses up into the mountains. There he is. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> Hello, Krishna. How are you? Namaste, namaste. <laughs> good to namaste, see you. Good, good to, to see, see you. you. Lovely to see yeah. you. No, I can take my bag, no problem. No, no, you sure? No, no, no. <laughs> so this is Krishna. <laughs> you can say hello, Krishna. Hello, I'm Krishna. <laughs> from Mount Mountain View Hotel. Yes, yeah, from Mount Mountain Hotel, View. Yeah. <laughs> Where he's invited us to stay for two nights and we're also going to go and explore the villages like I told you. And he's going to be showing us around. Yeah, sure. Definitely. <laughs> Thank you, Krishna. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> So we're supposed to be taking a jeep but apparently there's no jeep today so we're going to be taking a local bus into the mountains i'm excited for this whole experience it's going to be fun is this our bus the green one awesome. so this is the bus that we're going to be taking into the mountains i hope it's a 4x4 it's actually quite high but yeah it's gone through some wear and tear <laughs> but i think this is going to be fun quite excited to see how this thing actually drives up the dirt roads and up the mountains. I think it's actually a local bus. Uh, some people have goods to take on the bus as well. What is it? Don't refuse me now. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. So this is Sam. He's just given us something weird ah, to drink. A lychee drink. Yeah. So famous here. Can I take the bag inside? You may. Thank you. Thank you. you may. Thank you so much. Can I help you? Yeah. Can I help you? Oh, smart. Oh, here's a lychee juice. Mm. Yeah. That's actually really good. Yeah. That's fresh lychee juice, eh? Mm -hmm. That's really good. I love lychee juice. Can I try it? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you find this here? Yeah? Mm. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's really good. This is so That's good. Okay, let's go. You can go. <laughs> right, so this bus ride is going to take about an hour for us to get there. And if it goes by anything of what our bus ride was like from Kathmandu to Pokhara, I think this is going to be just as bumpy. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> this is what our roads look like. We don't really have roads. So this one is going to be just the same. <laughs> Very, also, very bumpy. Very bumpy. <laughs> yeah. But by going into the mountains, hopefully we can get more of a clear view of the mountains. We've seen tiny little peaks and glimpses of the Annapura Peak 1 from our bedroom window. But now being right in the mountains, I'm sure we're going to get a good look and I'm sure in the morning as well. So we're going to wake up super early to hopefully get a glimpse of the mountain range. This is also the bus that we're traveling on. Check how beautifully decorated the roof is. <laughs> We don't really have places to keep our bags, so our bags are just basically here on the floor. <laughs> and on top of us, they have like food for the buffalo and as well as their own food. So we're on a proper local bus here in Pokhara. So I just met a guy next to me that tells me he has summited Annapurna 1. Yes, yes. You summited Annapurna? Yes. That's crazy. Yes. What's your name? My name is Josh. Josh. And you? Daniel. Daniel. Yes, ah. nice to meet you, Josh. Thank you, thank you. One day I will summit, but maybe in the next life. Ah, okay. Not this <laughs> life. <laughs> but that's amazing, man. Well done. Yes, yes. <laughs> to think I'm sitting next to a guy that's actually summited one is just, I don't know, it's crazy. <laughs> don't know if I'd ever be able to do something like that. <laughs> <laughs> she was sitting on my lap and she disappeared very quickly. 
but it, as you can see, it's starting to get really packed inside this bus. Oh, oh. People are even standing yeah. as we go along. And we're just stopping and collecting more people, and I guess people will jump off and get on as they need. Done your board. So this cost us 320 Nepalese rupee, 160 per person. Oh my gosh, look at this road, we're gonna go up. And I think it's gonna wind all the way up the mountain. You see going up? crazy. <laughs> this is mad. Look at this road. <laughs> this is crazy. Look at the roads that we're going up. And we're in a bus. Can I tell you what this means? What? We're going to get to a part of the road where you can see a drop off the edge. Oh no, don't even tell me that. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Welcome to Nepal. <laughs> To think that these are roads that people travel on on a daily basis is crazy. But it's such an awesome experience for us. Namaste. <laughs> so yeah, we are almost in the village of where we're going to be staying for the next two days and we're high up in the mountains like there we can see some ice cap already and i'm sure in the morning when you wake up all this clouds are going to be gone and we're going to be able to see the mountain <laughs> these roads are rough though <laughs> we made it! So yeah, we just stopped on the side of the road on top of the mountain. And I guess once again, having bags like this... Not a good idea. No. <laughs> we needed bags like yours. Yeah, yeah, because we have to go all up there. Oh my gosh, so you got to <laughs> climb there. Let's go. Ooh, best way is to carry these things. <laughs> Let's go. I think we'll meet Krishna there at his house. The easy way or the hard way? Gee, do you see what I'm carrying? <laughs> well, you have a short way and that is up. Or you have long way, but it's... No, let's go. Let's go the hard let's way. Let's go <laughs> hard way and short. <laughs> okay. There we go. Are you fine there, baby? We really need to get rid of these bags. I feel like we're in the sticks here. I feel like it's just going to be easier to carry it like this. I'm excited for dinner already. <laughs> thank you, Danny. Don't even say thank you. <laughs> he tells me not to say thank you, yet he insisted on carrying my bag because he said it would balance him out. <laughs> I'm the one that says, let's get rid of these things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm out of breath already. Namaste. Namaste. Hey, we meet again. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Got some help. Check out how high we are. Even though we're climbing so many stairs, wow. the view is already stunning. This is all your land? Yeah. My uh, grandpa also born here. Oh, wow. My father also born here. Wow. I was also born. My kid was also born here. Wow. Oh, my goodness. So four yeah. generations. Yeah, four generations. Wow. But in this house. And my grandchildren was born in a hospital. In a hospital. Oh, okay. Yeah. So how old is this house? Hi. This house, maybe 500. Wow. 500, yeah. sure. That's all. Yeah. Long time, hey? Yeah, it is. Namaste. It's amazing. Four generations born in one house. You don't hear of that often. Hey. Hello, we're from South Africa. Africa. Yeah. What's your name? Leanne. My name is Jerome. Jerome? 
Sukom. Yes. Lovely to meet you. You? Are you a vlogger? Yes. Yeah. You want to say hello? Hi. Hi. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Sukom. Sukom and? John. John? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Bye bye. See you later. Okay. Bye. bye. <laughs> Making friends already. <laughs> Bye. Welcome. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> so here we are. Home sweet home. Yeah. Wow, you have a beautiful view here. Yeah. Yeah, this is beautiful. So this is Krishna's home and the view in front of his house. Incredible. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Krishna. Welcome. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> Daniel boy. They brought something for us. Oh, Danyavad. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Lemon juice. Thank you. Yeah, lemon juice. Is this lemon, lemon juice? Cold. Lemon? Lemon and mineral water. Ah, okay. Welcome drink. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. That's good. Good, eh? That's refreshing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Especially after the walk, eh? Yeah, sure. yeah. I'm very yeah. unfit. Thank you, Shelby. Oh, Danyavad. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah. So Krishna, this is your home, eh? Yeah. Just your home. Yeah. And then you have a home stay with the home. Yeah. Very beautiful. Yeah, very is. beautiful. Yeah. Thank you for having us. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> We'd like to also welcome to our place. Thank, thank you. you. Because so many years I was uh, planning uh, when I'm doing trekking, always I'm thinking, keep thinking, thinking to having this place but finally before the COVID we was born uh, Berlin also finished for the Berlin then it's closed oh shame so it's nice that it's open it's running now yeah and now the people can yeah. come here yeah, 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 sure, sure. <laughs> so we're actually staying in Krishna's house and he's got one two three rooms by the looks of it so let me show you the room that we're staying in so this is our room. We have a lovely chill area here, like our own little lounge. And before I show you outside, let me show you the bedroom. So we've got two single beds here and our own little cupboard. And it's lovely and spacious and light. But what's great as well is that it's got a bunk bed. So if you like a big family or a group of friends, then there's more than enough space for everyone. And then of course, we have our bathroom. But the best place, of course, is outside. We have this beautiful view and our own little balcony. How incredible is this? This is stunning. And they even have a table there. So I think that is where we're gonna be having our coffee tomorrow morning. I think it's gonna be like one of the best places we've ever had coffee, oh, hey? Agreed. And hopefully we'll have an amazing view of the mountains. It's a little bit misty now, but I'm sure in the morning it's going to be amazing. So beautiful. Yeah, so Krishna has actually invited us to come here. He's also going to be showing us around, like I've told you before in the video. So tomorrow we're going to go to some villages. We're also going to try and go to a local school here and also see some of the kids. So I'm really looking forward to tomorrow. This is uh, like a part of travel that we don't generally do and it's something we actually want to introduce a little bit more to the channel so i'm excited to show you a little bit of something that you do not often see on tv agreed so we'll see you in the morning so excited <laughs>